It's the Solid Signal podcast, and the date is May 9, 2016. I hope you're having a great week and a great month. You know, this month I've been tasked with trying to help our sister website, signalconnect.com, with some content. I'm part of that team as well. And it's brought up some interesting ideas for our podcast, and I'd like to share one of them right now. Not everybody out there is a business owner, so I know this podcast is not going to go out to every single one of you. Uh, But if you are listening this far, then you're a business owner or you know someone who is, and you're kind of interested in what I've got to say, and at least you're ready to poo-poo it, which is at least a step in the right direction. The, the question on the table is, why should a business owner, even a bar or restaurant owner, care about putting a signal booster, cell phone signal booster, in his or her establishment? After all, your employees come to work in order to work and not to sit on their cell phones, right? Your customers come to your bar or restaurant or tire shop or what have you in order to take advantage of your products and services and not to be on the phone, right? Well, I certainly understand that point of view, and I understand that a cell phone signal booster, something that is big enough for a large business or even a small business, could potentially be a little expensive. And I even understand the fact that expensive is something that you try to avoid when you're a business owner. A long time ago, I owned a business myself. But there's something here that you got to remember, and it's the basic principle of kindness and hospitality. When it comes to your employees, More and more, employees are looking for a good workplace, a place where they feel comfortable, where they feel valued, and that feeling is more important than money. That's right. You could potentially be paying your employees less if you give them a satisfying work experience. Of course, sooner or later, they're going to want more money, and I I get that, but the point is that giving employees a comfortable place to work, a place where they're capable of living their lives the way they want to live their lives is going to create happier employees. It's going to create retention. It's going to create a situation where everybody acts a little bit more like a family. And if you're a business owner, that's probably what you're shooting for. If we're talking about bars, restaurants, or any sort of public spaces, yeah, it's true. People come to your bar to drink. People come to your restaurant to eat. People come to your tire shop to buy tires but they don't come to you in order to be disconnected. There's a real feeling in the world today that being connected is incredibly important. Being connected to the entire world, whether it's Facebook or the news, or sadly enough, people use Facebook as the news, or your friends, or whatever it takes, nobody wants to be disconnected. That's very very important today. And if you're not providing a good, strong cell signal, then people are not going to be happy. They're not going to be satisfied. And if you think about it, it's actually a fairly inexpensive way to keep your customers satisfied over the long term. Yes, you pay some money up front, but after that, you're only paying for a tiny bit of electricity and you're providing good, strong cell service. So now I imagine that you're sitting in your office and you're listening to this podcast and you're imagining that this really still doesn't apply to you because you look down at your phone, you still have one bar, Well, you know, that's enough to make a call, right? The truth is that it's not. Well, I mean, of course, you're going to be able to make a call, and there may be a drop, there may not be a drop. There may be good sound or may not be good sound. It's not necessarily enough to give good data, which is more important than voice in a lot of cases. It's not enough to guarantee that that call won't drop. A dropped call, slow data, these are the kind of things that people kind of remember on a subconscious level. And... It's going to drive people's decision on where to work, where to shop, and that's just not something that you want. You want people to remember the experience that they have with you, whether they're an employee or a customer, as something positive, something that they want to continue. And really, when you think about it, an investment, even getting into a thousand or two thousand dollars in a cell booster, is not that big of a deal in order to get that elusive feeling of satisfaction. That's it for me. Have a great week.